Howdy everybody, this is Mrs. D, first grade teacher at Glendale Elementary with your latest edition of Sunday Stories. I'm excited to bring this story, Cowboy Boyd and the Mighty Calliope, to you this morning. It's written by Lisa Moser and illustrated by Sebastian Van Donick. I hope you enjoy it. No doubt about it, folks knew Boyd and Calliope were different the moment they rode into the Double R Ranch. The shortest horse I've ever seen, said Slim. That's the dustiest horse I've ever seen, said Hardtack. That's the luffiest horse I've ever seen, said Rancher Rose. She sure is a rare one, said Boyd. I raised her myself. He potted Calliope's thick hide and slid out of the saddle. We're looking for a place to call home. We'd be mighty obliged if you let us work on your ranch. I suppose we could try it, said Rancher Rose, eyeing Calliope. You won't regret it, said Boyd. I got a real strong belief in Calliope. Fence Minden was the first chore. Calliope did a good ha job hauling fence posts. Ker thud, ker thud, ker thud. But it did take a long time. I call that real talent, said Boyd. I call that real unusual, said Slim. I call that real slow, said Hardtack. Calliope's not a sprinter. She's more of a plotter, said Boyd, rubbing her dusty nose but she's real steady. Rancher Rose just shook her head. We moved the cattle to the north pasture, said Rancher Rose. You and Calliope ride on out into the range and bring home any strays you find. Count on us, said Boyd, plodding off on Calliope. Kerthud, kerthud, kerthud. We found some strays, said Boyd. Calliope wagged her tail. Uh, that's a prairie dog, said Hardtack. That's a jackrabbit, said Slim. That's a coyote, said Rancher Rose. They were drawn to Calliope's natural friendliness, said Boyd, giving Calliope a hug, like chicks to a hen. Rancher Rose just shook her head. She pumped fresh water into the trough. You two show Boyd where to bunk. I'll finish here. When the horses and Calliope finished drinking, Rancher Rose opened the pasture gate. Off to bed, she said. Kerthud, kerthud, kerthud. Calliope plodded to the pasture and blam! Straight through the pasture front fence. Blam! Straight through the barn wall. Blam! Straight through the bunkhouse door. She just doesn't know her own strength, said Boyd, tucking Calliope in. Rancher Rose shook her head. Boyd followed Rancher Rose out to the campfire. I'm real sorry, said Rancher Rose, twiddling her hat. But Calliope is not working out. Boyd stared at the fire and sighed. <sighs> That's a shame. Thing is, I think Calliope would have really surprised you. He stood up and he shook Rancher Rose, Rose's hand. We'll head out in the morning, said Boyd. I sure, we sure have enjoyed working here, even for a short bit. That night, a storm hammered the double R ranch. Thunder cracked and rain poured in buckets. Hours later, just when the bunkhouse had settled back to sleep, the door flew open. The cattle are gone, yelled Rancher Rose. Slim, hardtack, saddle up. Everyone rushed out. Boyd stroked Calliope's face. This is a dire situation, he said. But I got a real strong belief in you, Calliope. Calliope nuzzled Boyd while he pulled on his boots. When Boyd and Calliope caught up, the cowboys looked worried and their horses were blowing hard. I've never seen the cattle so skittish, said Rancher Rose. Every time we race in, they scatter like tumbleweed in a windstorm. If we don't round them up soon, they'll stampede. Mind if Calliope and I try? asked Boyd. Calliope's too slow, said Slim. Calliope's too clumsy, said Hardtack. Calliope is just what we need, said Boyd, smiling. Kutha, Kutha, Kutha. Calliope plodded onto the field, slow and steady. She went up to a baby calf and wagged her tail. She plodded a few steps and looked back. The baby followed. Its mama followed. The whole entire herd followed. Calliope led them all the way home. Blam! 
straight through the prickly bushes. Blam! Straight through the tangled briars. Blam! Straight through the bunkhouse door. You're some kind of animal, said Slim. You're some kind of cowboy, said Hardtack. You're Cowboy Boyd and the Mighty Calliope, said Rancher Rose. And we'd be mighty obliged if you would make your home on the Double R Ranch. We got a real strong belief in you. Cowboy Boy Holler. Yip, yip, yippee! Everyone cheer. Mighty Calliope rode in the dirt. The end. I hope you enjoyed Cowboy Boy and Mighty Calliope. Have a wonderful day. Yeehaw!